Hello, I'm Michelle Tiefetiller with Memoria Press, and I'm going to talk to you today about what you will receive when you order the Kindergarten Core Curriculum. One of the things in your box will be the Kindergarten Enrichment Guide. This is your um, instructions and weekly lessons for Kindergarten Enrichment. It will incorporate and talk about a set of art cards. There's one art piece for every, every week. It will also talk about the pieces of music with your music enrichment guide. This guide you're going to start in kindergarten, but it actually has information for first grade and second grade music as well. This year in kindergarten with enrichment, you're going to use both a child's book of poems and animals, animals. There'll be different poems each week from one of those books. And then there'll be a craft each week and you'll use your craft book, your kindergarten craft book. The kindergarten read aloud set that coordinates with the enrichment guide can be purchased at memoriapress.com. Next, you'll have a copy book, which has your memory verses, that you'll be, your memory verses and poems that you'll be writing each week. You'll have a composition and sketchbook. Um, this is where you will kind of develop some of your enrichment activities and do some writing together. Then you'll have the Bible portion of our curriculum. It will include your Christian Studies Enrichment Guide and your Story Bible. You're going to use both of these for kindergarten, first grade, and second grade. In kindergarten, we're going to study creation through the Exodus. But your guide here, your little enrichment guide, will give you Bible study information for the entire story Bible so that at Christmas, if you wanted to study the birth of Christ, you could have information for those lessons as well. For the math portion of our curriculum, we're gonna have a set of subtraction and addition flashcards The main portion of our math lessons will come from Rod and Staff. Now you'll notice that when you get your, your box that it has a one on it. Don't be alarmed. It, this is first grade Rod and Staff math, but in kindergarten we use the first workbook. So you'll get that first workbook for Rod and Staff level one, your teacher's manual for level one. You're gonna use this two years. And this big box of reproducible outlines black lines. Um, inside are about five million three-hole punched pages that have extra practice. These are reproducible so I would make sure you make copies instead of letting your child write on them. Um, make copies and you can make as many copies of those as you want. And you'll use that box in this year and next year too. Then Memoria Press has two other math books that we developed. Numbers books one and two. I guess this one's one one and two, and um, these are shorter, um, more independent activities that cover a few topics that Rod and Staff doesn't, doesn't cover. Those are part of your math as well. The last part of your box will be the phonics portion. It's going to include this big set of phonics flashcards, and the first thing I would do when you get these is to unwrap them, and then inside are dividing cards that divide the, the stack into sections. Divide those and rubber band them together and be sure you keep these cards in numerical order. It's gonna be a big benefit to you as you do your lessons. Next we have Classical Phonics. This is another book that's going to be used over multiple years. We use it in K, first and second grade. It's basically an anthology of uh, phonograms and word families. Next, we have First Start Reading. This is the bulk of your phonics and learning to read program for kindergarten. Um, it is the teacher's manual that tells you exactly how to do the lessons. So it's, it's even scripted for you. It will tell you what to do with student consumable book A, B, and C. Um, a, B, and C is going to take you through the entire alphabet. We take our time, and then book D um, will be the final part of the year. It's, in the, it's the last of the student consumables. 
In coordination with those books, we, we use Core Skills K, has a K on it, for kindergarten. And don't be confused when you see this, but there will be a Core Skills 1. We do use the first grade book in kindergarten. We use three phonetic readers in kindergarten, Fun in the Sun, Scamp and Tramp, Soft and White. All three books will be read in their entirety during the year. But we don't want to stop their reading at just at the end of the school year. We want it to continue over the summer or the break. So you also get this 100 days of summer reading, book one. And I'll, I'll note, have you note that in the back, there's a list of books that are graduated from least um, challenging to uh, even chapter books. The last part of our phonics program is the Christian Liberty Nature Reader, which gives you some information about an animal that begins with the same letter of the alphabet that you are studying. And then the students can color in animal alphabet um, various animals that begin with the same letter. Finally, we have our curriculum manual. I say finally, but this is probably the most important piece of your package as it has all of the weeks divided up for you. It tells you what to do each day of the week in each subject. It gives you a variety of information both in the appendix and in the pages um, at the beginning of the book. When you receive your box, actually I would look for this book first and open it to the very first page and you have a, an entire list of everything that your box should include. And that's what you'll receive when you order the Memoria Press Classical Core Curriculum for Kindergarten.